Yo guys, so today I'm bringing you a brand new video on my channel for boy. It's gonna be me rating all the Euro Euros teams and their key players. So yeah, let's jump right into it. So in Group A, the first team we've got is Italy. I think their key players is gonna be Donnarumma, who had 37 appearances in the league and had 10 clean sheets. Their other uh, key player is Barella. If you're wondering why I'm looking over there, they've got it all written down already. Barella with three goals and seven assists in the league, and Chiesa eight goals and eight assists in the league for Juve. My uh, my rating out of the ten for Italy is a solid seven point five out of ten. The next team is my team, so don't expect a little bit of bias, Jared. So Wales's key players: Gareth Bale, eleven goals and two assists, while on loan with Tottenham Hotspur. Aaron Ramsey, two, go two goals and four assists. He didn't play much games throughout the league for Juventus, but they're still good. And then Kiefer Moore, 30 goals and one assist. And Wales rating after 10 is 10. So yeah, let's get to the next team. The next team is Turkey. The key player is Yilmaz, who helped uh, Lille win the league, 16 goals and five assists. Chan Nogru is their next key player with four goals and nine assists. So they got a solid six out of 10. The next team, I think, is Switzerland. They got Jan Sommer in goals, who had 16 uh, clean sheets. And Akanji is the other key player, who had two goals from centre-backs. And I think Switzerland is a solid 6 out of 10. Group B. We got Denmark, Finland, Belgium and Russia, as you can see, right there. So, yeah. I think Denmark's key player is going to be Ericsson. He has three goals in the Serie A this season, not as good as he usually is. They have Schmeichel in goals with 11 clean sheets. And Pulisson with five goals and four assists. My overall rating for Denmark is 7 out of 10. Finland, I've only brought down one key player for Finland. And as you could probably guess, it's Timo Pukki with 30 goal contributions and 26 goals, four assists. Finland is a 4 out of 10. Now, Belgium, they've got loads of uh, key players. I've got De Bruyne, 6 goals and 12 assists. All of these stats are from the league. Every stat for the, all these players are in the league, no, no other competitions. Um, we got Lukaku, 24 goals and 11 assists, helping Inter Milan win the Serie A. And Courtois with 17 clean sheets and Belgium's team is a solid 10 out of 10. Russia, I've only wrote down two key players for these. i got Cherchev. Three assists and Glovin with five goals and nine assists. The year is a solid five out of ten. Group C, Netherlands. You got Depay with 20 goals and 12 assists. De Jong with three goals and four assists. Ake, he's going to be a key player, I think. But he didn't He didn't play much, so I have no, no stats for them. And Netherlands have got a nine out of ten. Ukraine is the next team. Gozinchenko, I didn't write any stats for him. I couldn't find any. Yarmachuk, 20 goals and 7 assists. Ukraine got a solid 6 out of 10. Next is Austria. I've got Alaba, who has got 2 goals and 3 assists from centre-back. He's now moved to Real Madrid for like 130 million. That's a mad. And Arnautovic with 3 goals in like 4 games for whoever he plays for. Got Austria 5 out of 10. Next is North Macedonia. I got Alioski with two goals, three assists. They got a two out of ten. For the next group, we got England, Croatia, Scotland, and Czech Republic. England is key players are uh, Harry Kane with twenty three goals, fourteen assists. Sancho with eight goals and eleven assists, and Rashford got the complete swap of the eleven goals and nine assists. England got a solid nine out of ten. Next is Croatia. I've only wrote them one, and it's Modric five goals and three assists. They got an eight out of ten. Next is Scotland. I got Andrew Robertson with one goal and seven assists. And McTominay with four goals and one assist. That's a five out of ten. Czech Republic. I've wrote down one for these. Sukek was a key part in West Ham's way to get in Europa League. Ten goals, one assist. Six out of ten for the Czech Republic. Group E you got Spain. Um, their key players, I think, is going to be Morata. Had eleven goals, nine assists. Adama Traore didn't write no stats. And Dani Olmo, 5 goals and 9 assists. 8 out of 10 for Spain. Next is Sweden. I wrote down 1 for these. It's Forsberg, 7 goals and 4 assists. 5 out of 10. Next is Poland. 
Lewandowski had 41 goals in the league and 7 assists. Uh, Szczesny had 6 clean sheets as a 7 out of 10 for them. Slovakia's key player, I think, is going to be Hamsik in the league. He only had one goal this season, which was very odd. But I think Slovakia's team overall deserves a 7 out of 10. The last group, the group of death, we got Hungary, France, Portugal and Germany. Hungary wrote on one and that's Galatsky. Their team is a 5 out of 10. France's key players, I forgot to add in N'Golo Kante, but he's going to be one of their key players. I got Mbappe with 27 goals and 7 assists and Karim Benzema with 23 goals and 9 assists. Portugal, I've got Cristiano Ronaldo with 29 goals and 3 assists and Bruno Fernandes with 18 goals and 12 assists. Germany got Tony Cruz who had 3 goals and 10 assists and Sane with uh, 6 goals and 9 assists. That is the end of rating all the Euro Euros teams. If you want me to do any more videos, let me down in the comment section below. Thanks for watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe and peace.